Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, thrill seekers of all ages. My name is Coaster Chow, Doncaster born, but built for theme parks, and welcome to a theme park newsroom update. Where today we're going to be looking at Canada's Wonderland because I've seen from a video from Amusement Insider who was at recently Canada's Wonderland. We know other people's going to be at the park uh, in recent in the next few days as well. Markings have been spotted. Now, there's, there's been other markings in a different area. I can't remember where, but that's apparently for a potential new restaurant or something like that on the hillside, on the Vortex Hill. But these are different markings. And the reason why these are different markings is because uh, these are around the Whitewater Canyon Rapids ride and the Action Theatre. Now, I've taken that site, used Google Maps, circled the whole site, they look like columns, the numbered columns, and it's potential coaster markings. So I'm going to talk about the possibility of a 2023 coaster. But before we get started, please like the video if you loved it. Comment down below your thoughts and opinions on this. I'd love to hear it. Subscribe if you're new around here. Click the notification bell so you never miss another video. Also, guys, check the description down below for social media links and the Google Forms link where you can submit your own ideas for the channel. And for now, guys, let's have a look at exactly what's going on with Canada's Wonderland and the potential markings for what could be a coaster for 2023. So for those of you who have no idea what Whitewater Canyon is, it's an intermittent river rapid ride that first opened in the Frontier Canada, well current Frontier Canada area of the park in 1984. Now obviously Canada's Wonderland has got this, you know, amazing, it's it, this amazing sort of um, theming going on with Whitewater Canyon, the waterfalls, you know, we miss Congo River Rapids with them waterfalls, uh, we get kind of jealous when you see waterfalls and other rapids around the world, uh, but but maybe Whitewater Canyon could bite the dust with the markings that's going on because as you can see on your screen right now it is a very very big site. Uh, now I'm going to share my thoughts on exactly why I think there'll be a brand new roller coaster coming to the park in 2023. So there we are ladies and gentlemen, thrill seekers of all ages, that is speaking about Canada's Wonderland and Whitewater Canyon and the action theatre spot uh, that's, been, that's been marked all over pretty much uh, with the number columns. Now, why do I think this will be a 2023 coaster? Well, Amusement Insider, and I've linked his video in the description down below so you can check it out for yourselves, um, he was speaking about all these reasons why it could be uh, a 2023 coaster. And there's loads of reasons to back this up. Um, there was something about a SARS meeting and, you know, Canada's Wonderland were due for a new coast to help bring the crowds in. And to be fair, this season I've heard reports that the, the crowds aren't as busy flocking back into the park as we come towards the end of the pandemic, you know, hopefully here in the UK. And, you know, America seems to have gotten quiet in certain places. So, you know, there's a, there's a big thing, you know, they sort of bring these investments in to draw the crowds back in. And Canada's Wonderland does not look that busy. So however that true that may be from the SARS meeting, uh, it should be interesting to see if Canada's Wonderland really do uh, add a new coast for 2023 and if it's due as well because obviously you know you guys remember 2019 Yukon Striker went in uh, so it'll be four years since Yukon Striker so I think in my opinion they could be due for another major coast to help bring the crowds back and of course investment brings the crowds back especially when we've learned from this pandemic as well give each other financial support that give them the investment they need and a uh, new coaster might not be the baddest idea for Canada's Wonderland Land. They need a coast to bring the crowds back, as is that report from the SARS meeting. And obviously there's two, two types of coasters that are on the radar at the moment that fans are talking about anything... They're not talking about anything but these two coasters. These are the two coasters in question. A map multi-launch and a B&M wing. That's the two coasters that are pretty much the primary targets for Canada's Wonderland fans. If you say new coaster for Canada's Wonderland, they're like, oh, B&M wing coaster, or they say, oh, map multi-launch, Copperhead Strike, or Gatekeeper, something like that. <laughs> Is it going to be Copperhead Strike? Is it going to be gate gate Gatekeeper? Uh, but, um... You know, what do I think? If it's 2023 coaster, what do I think? Map Multi Launch, they haven't got a thrilling launch coaster yet. They've got Bat Lot Stunt Coaster, which is their uh, sort of premier ride multi launch for families and family thrill seekers. They haven't got an extreme thrill seeker launch coaster. I think something like Copperhead Strike does fit the bill. Being a wing coaster, again, King's Dominion has shelved those plans. Could they have redesigned them and relocated them to a different park? Maybe it's not very far with their rumoured B&M. Uh, apparently, a uh, one of the subscribers commented saying they spotted some lime green track at the front of the B&M factory. What that's about, we don't know. Comment down below if you know much about that. But, um, you know, Knott's Berry Farm has been talked about for a B&M in 2022 or 2023. 
Um, maybe, maybe the shelf plans could have gone to uh, Canada's Wonderland and Nazis getting a b &M Hyper or a Giga, who knows? Uh, but I think it's very interesting to talk about. So, comment down below what your thoughts are on this. I'd love to hear your thoughts on this. But for now, guys, my name is Coast Shell, keep on the Coast Life. Please like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care, guys. Have a Canada-tastic day. I love that country. Thank you.